That was a bad decision, but uh, I did it. Today I'm doing a lookbook on my different like just personalities and traits that I possess, you know. Um, this is kind of low-key inspired by Call is Cool. You guys probably know who she is because she's literally a goddess and we all love her. So I hope you enjoy me sarcastically narrating myself and my personalities throughout this lookbook. And oh, update, I'm gonna be posting two times a week now. Which is super cool because like we finally got a sketch going. I'm not going to be one of those YouTubers who procrastinate anymore. Hey! So I hope you enjoy this lookbook and how stupid and dumb I'm going to look. So yeah. I'll see you next video or at the end of this one if I do an outro. And yeah. Bye. Okay, first outfit. We got me looking like a... T.O.P. Rejected Wannabe. And we got a shirt from American Eagle. Yes, stan it. Got a jacket from, I think, Kohl's. I really don't know. Got my leggings, which have camouflage on them, which I didn't realize until after filming this video. And we have a beanie, probably inherited. And I... God, I, I can't I can't do these videos anymore. I literally look like I'm posing for someone and it's so sad. Please ignore Oh, the legging up from Champion. Okay, here's me at peak laziness. As you can see, that hair is atrocious. Um, UBC sweatshirt, go Thunderbirds. We love that. Um, God, that hair is so ugly. God, no. Okay, yeah, cute. Yeah, please stop. Okay, next, my shirt is from, obviously, H&M because the quality of it. Um, I look like a mime in this, and I was, I think, trying to peak e-girl, make an aesthetic out of that, but, um, obviously, your girl can't be an e-girl, because she's not cute enough, and, yeah. Okay, here we have the, um, I am a youngblood stand. please stop making, please stop, just please stop me. Um, youngblood is love, youngblood is life. Oh god, I'm putting a beanie on, and someone someone cut it. Someone cut it right now. God, who, where's Cody Ko to roast me? Where is he? Okay, now we, I guess, have my skater girl aesthetic? What am I, like, 2009 Avril Lavigne? Someone tell me to stop. Please, someone tell me to stop. Oh yeah, that's cute. Uh -huh. Oh, here we have my favorite aesthetic. It's called the dad aesthetic. Um, it's not even aesthetic, it's just me being a dad. Um, I own like four of these shirts, and they just make me feel like, oh, like a really cool dad, you know, who's on a Hawaiian vacation just living their life. Living their life. And, you know, I feel like this all the time, and I feel like this should be a new trend. Dad aesthetic for the win. Okay. Goodbye, loves. Oh god, it's not over. Okay, now it is. No, it's not. Okay, bye. <laughs> and that's it. Probably were like, what the hell? And I was like, same. So basically, all my personalities slash just kind of like moods depend on those, like, let alone outfits sometimes. I know a bunch of them are really weird and I think honestly my favorite is like the dad, the dad vibe with the big like Hawaiian shirts and like that because that's honestly just kind of me in general and obviously like big guy shirts are like fun to be in generally but um yeah I'm a dork so I'll see you next time I think 
my next video is going to be a story time because that's what you guys voted on in my my poll on Twitter. If you guys want to be involved on those Twitter polls, feel free to hit me up and vote on my Twitter. It's the same as my channel name and my Instagram. And I'll see you next time. Bye.